step on the live well. Don't step on the live well. Why is that? Because a friend of mine fell through the live well the other day and broke the lid, so I haven't fixed it yet. Show me what we got going on. Oh, we got don't step through the live well. Ooh. Yeah, don't step on the live well. We got a 1987, 17 foot Fisher Marine aluminum riverboat. 40 horse Johnson, uh, runs like a dream. Wow. And I see you got the Minn Kota power drive. Minn Kota version one power yep. drive. Uh, just a simple Lorance unit, just an Elite 4X, something real simple. I run Navionics mapping on my phone. Okay, and by the way, you guys, today, we're gonna be doing some smallmouth fishing. And I'm out here with Chris King Fishing. And Chris, do me a favor. Are we gonna have fun? We're gonna have a blast. And we're probably gonna catch some fish, right? We're always gonna catch fish. Here we go. I saw, I'm not even kidding, the biggest crayfish I've ever seen is probably the size of my hand. All orange, spit out as fast, his mouth is amazing. But anyway, oh man, but anyway you guys, um, just to give you a quick recap, I've got four rods with me. I've got a spinning rod with a jerk bait, a medium casting rod with a Strike King 5XD, the medium heavy with the Karate OK that has a Texas rig that I can also use for a jig, and then I have, of course, the Gander Mountain Angler Bass Medium Moderate with the Crone Arc and the half ounce lipless crankbait. There's one. Oh, first fish of the day. I almost fell through it again. Yeah, it's just a little guy. Oh, yeah, it's a tiny fish, but hey, first one of the, the day, we'll take it. First fish of the day, exactly. Is this a hint of what's going on? Yes. He's fishing right tight up against this cover over here. Gotcha. All right. Chris King fishing with the first fish of the day. Good stuff. He's hooked up. On the Ned rig? Yep. Not real big, he was on the dam wall, so it felt like he was a lot bigger. He's right in the current. Gotcha. Little oh, guy. It's number two, but we're slowly starting to get something here. Did you get one? You just caught your crankbait. Was that your crankbait? Dude. He just, what? He just caught his crankbait. He just caught his crankbait that he lost. Don't do anything. Dude, stop, stop, stop. What the? Heck? That's incredible. I thought I had a fish. I'd reel it up and I'm like, somebody's lying and it's mine. Okay, well, we're stopped for a second. We are. We so, what you're saying is your motor's dead. It's not dead, but I just got, I either got to fix this wire or something. Okay. All right, you guys. Um, we're not doing so good at this first river. We tried the jigs. We tried the crankbaits, the Ned rig. He caught two fish. So, what we're going to do, Chris, is we are going to... We're going to move to another river about 30 miles from here. Um, do the same thing. We're going to be throwing crankbaits and jigs, and we're going to hopefully put something together. So Are we going to catch fish? Are we? That's all you can ever do is try. Oh, my I get God. After them. All right, so what you're saying is we're going to go under that bridge over there. Dude, you're you're insane. This is how we're getting to. What are you talking about? Okay. You ready? Yeah, I guess I'm ready. Spider infested, just so you know. Oh that oh geez, that's great. There's a big spider nest. Look up, there's a couple big ones right here for your piece. Where?
Look how close my hand is. To, look. Wait a minute, it ends right there? That's it. Which spot? See the corner of this, these metal beams right here? Hold on, maybe I can. Oh, he's hooked up. Small mouth. Good one. Oh, yeah. First good fish of the day. I can't see. Oh, that's a decent one. That's good. Yeah. So you're saying they're stacked there? Yeah. That one's there. Oh, yeah. Pretty one. A lot of nice colors in them. Yeah, dude, that's not a bad one. Right top of the mouth. Perfectly hooked. Gotta love it. Look at, they're not gonna hit that lipless, dude. They're not gonna, they're not gonna, like they're, gonna hit that they're not gonna hit a crankbait, no way. Yeah, I think you're right. No, I'm... Really? That's the third time I've done that. God. Oh, dude, and I had my bail open with my jig and I backlash. What the? I need to go right to it. There we go. That's good. Have you ever failed? Are you listening? Right there. That's a good one. Yeah, That's a good fish. Yeah. Yes. On the foot on the football jig. Hold on, dude. It's probably a. It's two. Yeah, I'd say that That's a sure. two-pound smallmouth. Beautiful fish, dude. Absolutely gorgeous. Great colors. On yes, it. my first good-sized smallmouth in a while. Good day or good, you know, good bite for what we had going today. That's a great way to start. Yes. Dude, look look at that fish. I, I bet you that's two, two and a half. Oh, yeah, that's all a two. That's a solid. He's thick all the way to the tail. Not a giant, but a nice one. Yeah, definitely a solid fish. Oh yeah, buddy. Hey, hey. Got him. That's a tiny fish. Tiny, tiny fish. Got him up. Still hooked up. Small mouth. Another one on the jig. Yes. See, these are the smallmouth I'm used to catching at the rivers by where I'm at. <laughs> I know, I'm gonna let you go. There we go. Okay. That He's the one that was hitting it, dude. Oh, dude, we're right up on this wall. That one hurt. That hurt bad. Yeah, I'm fine, but I just hit my shin hard. That was a hit. Got him. Oh, I missed it. That's a good fish. That's a big fish, dude. Oh, it's it's not a big fish, but he's fighting hard. Smalley. I got him. Flip him. No. And then on top of falling into the live well 10,000 times, well, you know. I hook like a pound and a half smallmouth, go to boat flip it and it comes off. <laughs> Another dummy move of mine. Oh. <sighs> oh, dude, I'm under it. That would be nice. That's a decent one. Got him. Got him. Got him. Well, looks like probably the little bit smaller than the first one that I, or the, excuse me, the one I missed, but ooh, no, 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 no. You're not jumping. Pretty fish. Here. There we go. Right under it. I get that all the time. Why don't you let it play with those really good Oh. That's where I give it right there. No, I popped it and hit it. No, dude. Got him. No way. Oh, that's a good one. Yep, get it over here. That's Oh man. 
that's got to be a three pounder. Nice three pounder for sure. Dude, they want the jig today. But dude, look at look at look at how his mouth looks a little weird. Great fish. On the on the black and blue jig, and look, he's got look at he's got rig mortis. Beautiful smallmouth bass. We're finally getting bites on the jig and the Ned rig, but now we're gonna go flip some docks, go fish other bridges, and hopefully we're gonna catch some more fish. What? <laughs> Wait a minute. What? I just set the hook on a on the black and blue jig. How big is that crappie? Dude, that's 12 inches for sure. That's 12 incher. That's a beauty. Wait a minute. I thought that was a what? Dude. That is awesome. Dude, Chris, thank you for taking me here. You're welcome, man. Now, wait a minute, for you guys watching at home, just so you know, hold on, let me release this fish before I say it. Away he goes. Now, back to what I was saying is, Chris, you do know if it wouldn't have been for you, I wouldn't have got this video. Hey, I do what I can. I just like putting people on fish, man. And if I were catching up, I had a great time. Did you get one? Big pike, big pike. I almost just fell in a big pike. Yeah. Oh, dude, that is a good pike. Pike on the jig. <laughs> Boat flipped the pike. <laughs> oh, I just broke my rod. I'll what? Just get it on camera. It might as well, right? Dude, the, he just broke his rod when he flipped it. Oh, shit. Oh, dude. <laughs> There he goes. Dude, pound it on Got the it. pike. Got it. Got him. It's a rock bass. Yes. Look at that rock bass. Dude, look at how fat. Dude, that's got to be a pound, wouldn't you say? Close. That's really close to a pound. Dude, smallmouth, yeah. pike, crappie, rock bass on a black and blue jig, black and blue, blue Ragecraw trailer, and a Ned rig. This. Wow. That's way too cool, one dude. On lipless this morning. Oh, that's right. You got the one on the crankbait. One. All right. I got to get the release. There we go. Big, nice oh, dude, that's a nice smallmouth. Oh, yeah, dude. Just another quality, healthy fish. Definitely. That's definitely a nice largemouth. Smallmouth. Excuse me. Why did I just call it a largemouth? That's Because <laughs> that's mouth. what we're trying to catch at this point. Away he goes. Dude, pound it. That was awesome. Dude, what a that day. so awesome. That is going to be it for Chris and I for the day. And if you want my opinion, that was a good day, especially for the conditions we had. But before we go, Chris, do me a favor and give the viewers an outro. Thanks for watching. Just to let you guys know, if you want to go check out Chris's YouTube fishing channel, I'm going to have his channel link down in the description below and no i do not mean at the bottom of the description i mean it's going to be the first line so go ahead and check that out he's a really good guy and he actually helped put me on the fish today i hope you guys enjoyed and we had a blast we had a awesome. blast it was awesome till the next time i can't believe i almost forgot
Wait a minute. I did not think this was going to be a video filled with animals. 